Gene, I had a, a very, very pleasant surprise when I came in here. Uh, I, I met your dad out there, and I didn't hardly want to believe uh, my eyes. I didn't, I didn't know he was coming out here. Is it a surprise to you, too? Yeah, it was a, quite a surprise to me, too. He, he sneaked in on us. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's wonderful to have him out here, the whole family out here. Who all came out, Jim? Well, my mother and, and sister and brother-in-law came out. Uh-huh, and they're here with us this evening? Well, just my dad's down here and my brother-in-law tonight. You remember, you remember last year when we had him up on the bench, and we had so many wonderful comments? So many letters saying that they enjoyed him so much singing with you. <laughs> you, <coughs> you, uh, you think we might be able to uh, get him up here again? Uh, I don't know. Huh? I don't well, know. But the thing to do is ask him. I think he might obey you better than me. Huh? I don't know about that. <laughs> How about it? Would you like to come up here a little bit this evening? A wonderful surprise. Are we ever happy to see you? And last year when you sang with us, uh, the, the folks commented so wonderful about it that I think it'd be uh, real nice if I could get you to sing a with the sun a little bit again. Just a little. A little Irish song? <laughs> okay. Well, it's a little a Peggy O'Neill. <laughs> Peggy O'Neill was a girl who could steal any heart anywhere, anytime. Now I'll put you wise, how you recognize this wonderful girl of mine. If her eyes are blue as skies, that's Peggy O'Neill. If she's smiling all the while, that's Peggy O'Neill. She walks like a slight little rope. If she talks with a cute little rope, a sweet personality full of rascality, that's Peggy O'Neill. Patty Rooney's got a fella, Looney, but a million fellas get the feeling fully when they meet. Peggy O'Neill. Why, if there was nothing for Molly over till the mama knows that she could never stand a show sweet. Peggy O'Neill. Rosie Grady was a perfect lady with a simple winning baby smile, but Peggy is a simple, that is why she has the other girlies need a mile. So if you meet a girlie sweeter than the dealer, and you feel you want to stay along the dealer, that's Peggy O'Neill. But due to the fact that we didn't have this rehearsed, I noticed you got off in a little spot there, and I had a chance to hear your solo voice, and it was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> would, you, would you mind singing just a little solo for us here, too, on the show? Me, my sweet melody called doodly doo with doodly doo. I like the rest, but the one I like best is doodly doo, doodly dee. The simplest thing there isn't much to it. You don't have to sing, you just doodly do it. I love it so wherever I go, I doodly doodly do. Please play for me that sweet melody called doodly doo, doodly doo. I like the rest, but the one I like best is doodly doo. Simplest thing there isn't much to it. You don't have to sing, you just do doodly do. I love it so wherever I go, I doodly do doodly do. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful! Isn't he wonderful? Ah, uh, Frank. I don't know how I can thank you for this. I'll get hotter. Let me, let, me, <laughs> let, me ask you a, let me ask you a question that I'm sure my audience, they want me to ask this question. Uh, would you consider leaving the farm and singing with champagne music? No, I wouldn't leave the farm for nothing, I'll tell you. <laughs> well, I, I, I didn't mean for you to leave it for nothing. I'll tell you a little bit. <laughs> 
Well, oh, don't get so hot. We're not going to take you away from the farm right away. Thank you so very much. Let's give him a big hand.